Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Mona Project. We here at the Mona Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to inspiration, uh, guidance, and advice for Jews uh, who are returning to Judaism for uh, uh, B'nai Noach, for Noahides, and also for converts, people who are going through the conversion process or have recently converted. And uh, I'm reminded uh, of the story of uh, Rabbi Avram, the angel, the Malach. This is this would be the son of Rav Dov Ber, uh, the Mag of the Mezrich. So why do they call him an angel? Um, apparently, uh, Rabbi Avram uh, had a, this look, this face, this countenance that almost seemed uh, spiritual. It had like a glow to it. Similar things are told about the Baal Shem Tov. You know, just you, you looked at him, and he had this 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 spiritual energy, this glow. A lot of people were frightened by it. A lot of people were intimidated by it. More so uh, Rabbi Avram the Malach. But uh, what I want to talk about uh, Rabbi Avram, the angel, is not his uh, angelic countenance. Um, his, uh, his approach to fighting the Yetzirah. This is something I've mentioned before, but uh, uh, Rabbi Avram puts it very well. He said, I learned a new form of service from the wars of um, uh, King Frederick, uh, the King of Prussia. It's not necessarily to approach the enemy uh, head on in order to attack him. Um, in fleeing from the enemy, in running away from the enemy, um, it's possible to circumvent him as he advances, and then attack him from the rear and force his surrender. Uh, I've mentioned before in previous videos um, that the Yetzirah rarely attacks uh, head on. It comes at you from the side. Rabbi Avram is saying, and also making reference to the King of Prussia and the wars, he says, uh, sometimes the best way to get someone isn't by advancing and attacking. Retreating, having the enemy follow you, and then do, do an end run, and then get him from behind. Um, what's needed, according to Rabbi Avram, is not to strike the evil impulse uh, directly, but to withdraw to the source of divine power, the Creator, and from there circle round and go at the, uh, the Yetzirah bend it and transform it into its opposite. So in other words, um, by doing so, by doing an end run, going at it from behind, you're not only um, forcing its surrender, you're actually transforming, according to Rabbi Avram, the Malach, the, the angel, you're transforming the Yetzirah, the evil inclination, into the Yetzir Tov, the good inclination. We're going to be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back, please watch, please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Imuno Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you so much.